Hey guys, today I'm gonna to show you how I would use a fork and knife to cut a steak using my ability hand. So to start off, we're going to use a fork in the ability hand. And for me, what works best is being in key grip. So you can open the key grip and then wedge the fork in between the index and middle finger. And once you get it through, just align it back with the thumb. And then you can close down with the thumb. Now I can use a knife in my left hand put some pressure with the ability hand and start cutting. And we can also use a knife in our ability hand. So for, for me, what works best is to be in power grip and then you can position the knife where you'd like it to be and kind of let the fingers conform around it. So you can see the pinky and ring finger is supporting the back of the knife, the middle finger is supporting the front of the knife, and the index finger is actually putting pressure down on the back of the handle. So I can use a fork in my left hand now and cut like this. So when eating with a fork and knife using the ability hand, there's a couple of things you can keep in mind. One, you can always lock the hand. For me, I can press the power switch in three times which by default will lock the hand. So that'll prevent me from accidentally opening or closing the hand when I'm applying pressure while cutting a steak. Uh, another thing to keep in mind is, depending on your socket setup, might have a slight restraint of motion. That's why I prefer to use the fork in my left hand. And that is how I would use a fork and knife to cut a steak with my ability hand.